What a lovely day. The sun is shining, Doctor Who is in syndication, and I had a Diet Pepsi. You don't like Diet Pepsi. You uh, drink orange. You drink Dr. Pepper. Uh, you don't drink pe Diet. You're so silly. Okay, Charles. Okay. Your doctor called. He said you didn't pick up your medication. I don't think I really need it at the moment. Okay. Mr. I talk to vacuum cleaners. Why'd you throw, lock the closet and throw away the key? Because? Yeah. Rosie, your vacuum cleaner uh -huh. was misbehaving. So I put her in time out. Now, go do it. Get me a, the Christmassy ones. The holiday ones. You know, Jenga, Linda, Lee, Bill. Okay, peace out. Wait, you no, can't do it, but you see me too. This is getting awkward. Of course you can. Okay. So Rudolph the Red Nose Cowboy had a little oh, kitty cat. And if you ever saw him, you would say his cat was fat. And all the other reindeer, well, they did, had a reindeer. I better go work on okay. rapping. Uh, 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 okay. Uh, 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 you know, rapping. Right. Rapping. You got it. Rapping. Right. Like, you know. Christmas well, is the time for the season. <laughs> What's the movie you don't like? No, oh, it's not Jack Frost, is it? Listen, I know you don't like that one. Oh, of course I do. He's such a cute, fluff, fluffy little snowman. Unfortunately, it's not. It's not the one we're talking about. Uh, what do you mean? Um, this one is a horror movie, apparently. Mm, that's just not right. Unfortunately, it's not. You're right. No, look, he's a little snowman, you know, little carrot nose. Um. Collab balls. I guess I'll, I guess we're gonna get Ryan and keep talking about it. Alrighty, well, you work on that sweet little Jack Frost movie with that little snowman, and, um, I'm going to go whip up a bunch of cookies. I'm going to make snowman cookies. Do you want yours with extra sparklies? Uh, sure. Okay. Greetings and salutations. How's everybody doing? So today's film is a bit of a horror film that has a bit of a cult following. Today's film is on, a review is on, Jack Frost from 1997. And no, we're not talking about the Michael Keaton version. We're talking about the other Jack Frost involving the killer snowman. Yep. This film was directed by Michael Cooney. And it was also directed by, I mean, written by him. So. So the cast includes for this film, Michael Scott as, m wait. Michael McDonald as Jack Frost, Christopher Alaport as Sam Tiller, Steve Mendel as Agent Manners, F. Lee Parker as Paul Davro, Ellen Sully as Alan Tiller, Rob LaBelle as Agent Stone, J Zach Zink Inginton as Ryan Tiller, Jack Linden as Jack Jake Metzner. Kelly Jean Peters as Sally Mitzner, Marsha Clark as Marla, and Shannon Elizabeth as Jill Metzer. Has a big, 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 big cast in it. So, uh, what was the story or the plot of Jack Frost? Well, the plot of Jack Frost involves a killer who gets, well, he gets sprayed with extremely hot chemicals and dies and comes back as a giant 
walking, talking snowman. So yeah. Some of the, so yeah, that's the basically just of it. And he's trying to get a revenge after the cop, cop who basically found him and turned him in. How much simpler can you get for a plot? That's very simple. I gotta say, well, having seen this many times, many, many, many times, this film is still entertaining as it can be. Extremely entertaining. The kills of this film are actually, I mean, even though they, they're quite silly, whether it's a sl uh, a kill from a sled oh. ah! <laughs> or heck even getting killed by a giant sh like by getting killed by a giant snowman by use of Christmas ornaments or heck even being almost eaten eaten with razor sharp teeth yeah the kills in this film are ridiculous so but yeah I gotta say, the beginning of this film opens rather silly. It starts with a grandfather telling his uh, granddaughter, like, say, a, a st story, but he gives her a scary story. And they basically, he just not holding punches, he goes, like, say, Jack Frost was a killer. Jack Frost did all these crazy things. He did all these things. And, he just, and he basically, and you just see this, like, she didn't really tell this little girl things, even though she wanted a scary story. Probably he probably really shouldn't. Some of some of the acting is, eh, it's it's fun. It's not. You're not trying to. You don't have to take it seriously. World's most pissed off snow cone. I mean, the actors aren't taking this thing seriously. Like at all. I gotta say the most ridiculous death sequence is actually Yeah. I really can't say it, mostly just because I really don't know what will happen. Well, I mean it's on YouTube. You can find it. Uh, yeah. Basically, uh, Jack Frost, uh, he basically is able to melt himself into water, and then he can reform himself as snowman. Snowman. So there's a sequence where a woman is taking a bath, and he, um, uses his uh, carrot as um yeah that's as far as I'm going to say because I really don't know like how I don't know I mean it's kind of funny watching because <laughs> I mean it's a giant freaking snowman it's so silly the uh, I mean, there's a, like a lot of like a lot of uh, silly things about this movie. Heck, there's like a moment where they the co uh, uh sheriff, the FBI agents, they're all going after Jack Frost, and one way they finally like, say, "Okay, what do we know about uh about snow and snowman?" Aha! They can't handle the heat. So they use air dryers. 
and totally make a decision course right now. But the one way they were able are able to get rid of Jack Frost and take him down for good. Well, one way, well, in the, I have, like one way is like say that you're able to get rid of snow <coughs> if you live in coastal, I mean not coastal, mountain areas, is the use of antifreeze, you know, which melts snow. So they fuel a thing full of antifreeze, and the sheriff. And Jack Frost fall into it. Jack Frost starts to melt. He wants revenge. At least until the next film happens. And Jack Frost 2. Which has... Little mini Jack Frosts. Yeah. It's ridiculous too. I gotta say, uh, like, say, like, one of the like, more, most, well, I mean, I've probably already said as many memorable things about this film, like, from the kills and all that stuff in this, from this film. One of the moments where I think, okay, that's a funny little side gag, is Jack Frost in the middle of the road with a stop sign. But yeah, I mean, this film, I feel like this film is fun. I mean, it's probably not the kind of holiday film you want to watch during the holidays. I mean, I guess you can. It's silly. But, what do you guys think? What, have you, what do you guys think of Jack Frost? Not the Michael Keaton film. Because if you keep on feeling we're talking about the Michael Keaton film, I'm sure. I mean, I feel like, say, if Michael Keaton's Jack Frost was doing all this stuff, it'd be a lot different. But, what do you guys think? Put your thoughts and those comments down below. And as always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. had fun today. Yes, we did. I didn't. I've been locked inside a closet. <gasps> Better put that vacuum cleaner back in the closet. I don't know who let it out.